This drone has recently generated a lot of news coverage and noise in Ukrainian skies. The wandering missile known as Shahid-136 is a hybrid of a drone and a cruise missile, an Iranian loitering munition autonomous swarm pusher prop aerial drone that has been in use since 2021. Its main purpose is to launch distant ground attacks on targets. The relatively inexpensive drone, which is launched in multiples from a launch rack in batches of five or more, is intended to overwhelm ground targets while evading air defenses while absorbing air defense resources during the attack. Through published video in December 2021, the drone was made public. It is thought that the device was initially actively implemented in Houthi-controlled regions of Yemen. The drone is roughly 440 pounds in weight, 11 feet long, and has an 8.2-foot wingspan. It can fly at above 115 miles per hour. According to reports, the range is between 1,100 and 1,600 miles, providing it the potential to loiter. The aircraft is shaped like a cropped delta wing, with stabilizing rudders at the tips and a central fuselage that blends into the wings. The warhead and the optics necessary for a targeted strike are both located in the nose section. In a pusher configuration, the engine is located at the back of the fuselage and propels a two-bladed propeller. The aircraft are launched roughly horizontally at a small upward slant, and rocket launch assistance is used to help them in their initial flight, RADO. After launch, the rocket is promptly destroyed, leaving the drone's standard Iranian-made Mato MD-554 cylinder piston engine in place, possibly a reverse-engineered. Other Iranian drones, such as the Ababil 3, takes over, also use the Limbok L550E. The launch frame and drone assembly are portable, allowing for mobile hit-and-run operations that can evade countermeasures. The entire device can be installed on the back of any military or commercial truck. When Russia invades Ukraine in 2022, Russia has been accused by Ukraine and its Western allies of employing the Shahid-136 as of September 2022. Despite having a new name and a Russian designation guarantee, Iran has consistently refuted reports that it sent weapons to be used in the conflict in Ukraine, claiming that it is impartial in the conflict and that the allegations are untrue and the product of an anti-Iran propaganda campaign. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thanks.